What's going on YouTube? So it's Martin and Christina from Thrift Store Gold. Gold back at you with another video. So today's video we're going to be talking about what's up with eBay. Items They've been specifics. Item specifics. Everybody's been talking about them. You probably know about it by now. So we're going to give you a rundown of what happened and what we're going to be doing. So let's get this intro. We'll be right back. Thank you for coming to my bed. You're welcome. All right. So what's going on, guys? Now that you guys are back from that intro, how's it going? How's everybody's day going? How's your night going? It's nighttime for us. It so, is midnight. Midnight. So <laughs> we're filming this video because we want to just share with you guys what we're going to be doing. I'm pretty much going to let Christina take it from here on out. So enjoy. So as you guys probably know or now know, uh, eBay went through an update yesterday. Yep. So on... October 15th they went through an update and added a new size category basically a required size category in clothing listings um, so a lot of clothing listings that you have probably are missing the sizes or were missing the sizes right now uh, eBay did put out an update that they were trying to actively fix it um, but we just wanted to be like proactive on it mm -hmm. and work on it now but yeah. basically all in all um, sizes are missing the colors are missing um, important things that are required for your listing to show up in search results are missing from your listing so it's not taking away your listing no but um, in search results your listing is less likely to show up if it has the missing information because it doesn't or it doesn't like populate that up if that oh, makes okay. sense so it's not going to register that you have a l size large shirt uh, because their new item specific is a blank category so so lame because <laughs> it kept the sizes yeah in a separate one but there's a new one now that's a requirement so you have to go through or at least what we're doing is we're going through and updating all of them yeah. now like we said eBay did say they were going to try and fix it but we just want to be really proactive on this and just I mean we kind of took this as almost motivation and kind of like as the start of being entrepreneurs yeah. like taking the life role on we need to adapt to situations that happen adapt to things that get thrown to us so mm -hmm. yeah we could sit around and wait for eBay to fix it if they ever do yeah but who's to say that they do fix it it could you know? be months so and, and we could be losing yeah. out on all that just good stuff that Christina's hard work and everything I know. so we're gonna literally stay up all night doing that I'm trying to help Christina she says like I won't be able to help her so she's gonna be doing it all so leave in the comments down below Christina you got this and just know guys you got this too but also if sorry. you do take on the role <laughs> A big thing for us though is that a lot of people that we're hearing from is that they're like oh we're gonna wait we're gonna wait you know mm -hmm. um, but we decided to take the bite on it and really just think like all right well this is our opportunity and our chance for our listings to show up higher now yeah. so when people search uh, blah 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 large shirt um, ours should hopefully come up to the closest of the top for right now at least mm -hmm. um, so honestly anything can that could help our sales is worth it for us yeah it's worth it to put in the time and the effort even if that means staying up a little longer um, and I'm not trying to say like oh we'll have higher listings than the people that aren't doing work it's just no. what we want to do it's what we almost have to do because yeah. we're young and hungry at this point exactly we don't want our eBay store to have sizes missing or categories missing for months because who's like like we said who's to say ebay is going to fix it right yeah. now like and this it, is just our opinion exactly so don't take this with any take it with a grain of salt yes. i guess because <laughs> we're just new ebay sellers we haven't even done this for over a year yet no. so you can tell <laughs> comment down below if we're wasting our time but this is what we're going to be doing all night i'll show you a screenshot or a screen video of what christina has to be doing because it's not the best but it's not that long and she's pretty quick at it As, so yeah it's mindless work you know yeah. i have the size in the title for most of them and like i said uh ebay kept 
the other uh, size in a little category down below so you can go and look at that but literally you just have to scroll down where it's, yeah. uh, it has the red highlighted field and just type it in and then next you know it's so not bad. it's not too bad but yeah it's just kind of silly that ebay is almost basically like sorry we're not gonna fix it right seriously, now seriously <laughs> yeah they're just like oh we'll get to it yeah hopefully i mean we don't know but that was our video we hope you guys enjoyed make sure to smash that like button if it helped you in any way Leave a comment down below what you're going what you're gonna do with this whole issue with eBay you're and everything. Leave it or fix it. <laughs> yes, exactly. Or if you're just gonna leave eBay in general. Just I'm close. get off of it. Yeah, I'm we're close. done. Honestly. So thank you guys for watching again. We really appreciate you. Till next video, go crush it. Peace. Wish Christina luck.